pretty much what I want to talk about is quality over quantity because honestly in my life I've really gotten like I don't even want to say confused but the best word probably is confused because I found myself going back and forth from like okay should I focus on quality and take longer and not have as much quantity out there or should I just go for quantity and you know put the perfectionism and the quality to the side and just go ahead and honestly what I found that works best for me is like when I go at my own pace and I'm focused on quality because you know some people may be able to push out content like create and put a lot of content out there and it may be quality but for me personally I'm not a quantity ass dude like I'd rather put out one video a month and that video would be amazing than put out four mediocre videos that I'm not really proud of I'm not even like excited to push the videos or the music or whatever it is um yeah like that's just not me so that's i'm just telling y'all what i'm what has worked the best for me i'm not telling you what you need to do in your life i'm simply telling y'all um this is how i'm moving forward with my life because to be honest at this point my channel is like a documentary for whatever i want to say i'm i'm trying to really i'm not even trying i am disconnected from every like trend and all that shit um i started doing vlogmas i was like oh i want to do vlogmas but then I sat about it, sat down and thought about it. I was like, why am I doing vlogmas, bro? I'm literally doing it because I see other motherfuckers doing it. And I think, and in my head, I'm like, yo, I'm going to do it because I need to put quality. I mean, content out there. You know, I need more quantity, quantity. But like, what is quantity if it's not quality? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know if y'all heard, like, what is having 50 hoes if none of them are satisfying you for real? But imagine having one girl or one person, one partner and she hitting all of the check boxes and you don't need the 50 hoes you see what i'm saying so it really is quality over quantity like not even just with fucking like partners but in general bro like i used to be like oh i need to put out a song a day but the song when i'm rushing myself in the process like it's just not good and that this is not to say that in the future i'm not going to be putting out dummy quantity i'm just talking about right now for christian julian tigbalu that shit is not working for me. Like, I don't want to feel like I have a timer on my ass. I don't want to feel like I'm putting out content for the sole purpose of blowing up or making money. Like, I don't give a fuck about that shit. Like, I genuinely don't give a fuck about making money from YouTube, music, none of that shit. Obviously, it's nice to have money, but, like, that's an after effect. You feel me? Like, I don't give a fuck about that shit anymore. Like, I just want to make music that sounds good. I just want to cook, make food that tastes good, that my fam eats and it's delicious, that I eat and I like. I don't give a fuck about business shit. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. It'll, it'll come. You feel me? Because when I have all that at the forefront, it's never good. Like, it's just not. You feel me? Like, I want to make a YouTube video because I generally want to go out and make a YouTube video. I don't want to make a YouTube video because y'all are asking me to make a YouTube video. I don't want to make a YouTube video because I see everyone else doing a certain type of video. I don't want to make a YouTube video because for all the wrong reasons. I want to make it because I woke up and I said, hmm. That would be really fulfilling if I went out and I made this, you know, like I want to make food because hmm, that would be really fulfilling if I woke up and I made that. Like I want to do shit for me, no outside influences. Now, this is not to say as well. I do get inspiration from people, but that inspiration is just used like 10 percent to actually create what I'm creating. So if I see someone make a video, right, and I like what they're doing, I'm not going to steal it completely and go do it and, and, and go run with that. But I will take it as inspiration and go make it my own and do what. I want to go do with it like to the point where you won't even know that i got inspiration from that person because our our content is so separate type stuff so yeah honestly i have been dabbling with that like struggling with just being authentic to me and not trying to chase other people's or trying to follow or copy other people's strategies for making it out here because one person's way is not gonna work for me like it just doesn't like you know i i used to always watch people and be like damn he, she, they, they're posting, they're posting a video every day and I'm not, so I ain't shit. No, like I'm not you, I'm not them, we're not the same people, so our timelines are different. I'm not gonna blow up at the same time you are. I'm not gonna have the same amount of money as you. I'm not gonna be the same person as you. Me being my best self and you being your best self look completely different, you feel me? And this is also, even with fitness, but I have to take a step back from a lot of things and just reevaluate why I'm doing it like I would watch a lot of fitness youtubers and some of them a lot of them would be on steroids and I'm like damn they look so ripped blah blah, blah and I'm I don't, I don't look like that but in reality like bro 
compare compare me to me two years ago, I look amazing right now. I look fucking ripped, fucking amazing. Like jack, I look amazing, amazing. And this is not even my peak yet. But then when I compare myself to some fucking YouTube bodybuilder ass that's on steroids and is not me and has a completely different trajectory of life. You know, obviously I'm not them, so I can't even compare myself to them. Like, I, I really have to stop comparing myself and trying to be like other motherfuckers, bro. Every time I do that, I get lost. But every time I say true to myself and I do things because I want to do them, like, life is great. Simple. So, yeah, I just want to encourage y'all. Bro, quality over quantity. If that, You feel me? Like, I, I honestly think this goes across the spectrum. Like, it's not even just with me. Quality over quantity. You know, quantity is not shit if it's all ass. What is 50 videos? What is 50 songs? If none of them have purpose, intention, you didn't put your heart and soul into it. It's just the, oh, I need to put, put a video out. Oh, quantity, quantity, quantity. You feel me? This is me right now. Like I said, I don't know where I'm going to be at in the future. I don't know what I'm going to be doing in the future. So this is just me speaking on right now. Like, yeah. Um, I also want to preface, uh, for anyone in general, don't hold people's words against them. The things I say today are not may not be valid tomorrow because my opinions and my perspectives can change literally instantaneous i'm about to dip out because okay i'm like the only person in this parking lot and i think that i'm at a dog beach in long beach and it's kind of closed but yeah that's basically what i wanted to say bro quality over quantity like for real that shit is just per because yeah bro per i'm per i don't even have to elaborate anymore because just per